June 9th, 2008. From Atlanta, hi, I'm Brad Fallon. Welcome to the Free Line. First up, well, the Steve Jobs keynote at the Worldwide Developers Conference 08 is happening right now. Bloggers are sharing live play by plays at the conference, plus some pretty good color commentary. So far, it looks like the iPhone 2.0 is going to move the line quite a bit, including big applause for the way Apple came up with to push stuff to your phone instantly when you need it, rather than running apps in the background all the time, which drain your batteries and make everything run slower. You can follow the link at FreelineReport.com to see what the live bloggers are saying from the audience, complete with visual aids. Despite the many advances in web technology that Opera has brought to the browser community in years past, such as tabs, the browser has consistently lagged behind Firefox in terms of popularity. But recently, they struck a deal with Hot Secure to deal with malware right in the web browser itself. That's a pretty cool idea. So far, Opera is the only browser that has anti malware support built in. It's unlikely that anyone will really care, though, given all the hype surrounding the release of Firefox 3. Even before Mozilla announced the big download day for Firefox 3, Guinness Book of World Records and all that, the internet has been abuzz about the new features it's going to support. Now, if you're not into beta testing for whatever reason, like it breaks all your plugins, we've got a video link that shows you exactly how cool the new web browser will be in final form. New features include an improved address bar and smarter bookmarking. Now, if only it had native support for web clippings, we'd be golden. Well, fortunately, you can do just that with the free scrapbook plugin. Just highlight what you want to save, tag it, and store it in your bookmarks for later. It also saves a snapshot of the current page, so even if the site changes, your web clipping will still look the same. And if you're not a fan of Firefox and would still enjoy the same type of feature in, say, Safari or Internet Explorer, well, Google Notebook can pull this trick off with no sweat. In fact, this feature has just recently been added to Google Reader, so you can even clip and save portions of your favorite blogs right from your favorite feed reader. And finally, if you're a Mac user, Google has a present for you. We've got a link to some cool tools that Google employees have been developing in their free time, all of them targeted towards OS X. They have everything from an image search application for the desktop to a program that automatically lets you record directly from your iSight camera to YouTube. And it's all free. Thanks again, Big G. Until next time, for The Free Line, I'm Brad Fallon. For Web 2.0 news you can use in 2.0 minutes, visit FreelineReport.com.